Hello, my YouTube family. How's everybody? Um, so first I want to say welcome to anybody that's new. And if you have already been a part of my family, welcome back. Um, so my name is Sam. And I once upon a time had a YouTube channel and um, things were going good. And then life happened. Okay. So I am back. Um and hoping and praying that I can get back to where I was before. Um, but, you know, work, balance, um, mom of four, you know, it's always something going on. I literally just fell off. Like, there was no more getting back to anything. So, now I am back. Also, I had to go ahead and start this back up because me, my sister, and a friend of mine, um, we're looking into starting... <laughs> we're looking into starting a um, podcast and so I wanted to um, get back on here you know familiarize myself and my viewers with me and um, you know get back to everything before we started the podcast so I don't have much going on today but just trying to get back into the swing of things just trying to um, you know lighten the mood before we get it going but i can't wait i'm so excited that's something that i love to do and if y'all know me y'all know i love to talk so i'm all over the place but i also love to listen as well so um i'm always here i try to do a lot of like advice and things like that i don't do no hair i don't do no makeup um don't know how but anything else i'm here for it i am a diy and a crafter person so the the Dollar Tree DIYs and the home craft projects and things like that is normally what my channel is about um, and the things that I usually do because that's my life. Like, that's what I do. So, again, just wanted to welcome everybody back. Well, I'm going to say welcome all together because, and I'm so thankful for all the followers that I ever had. Um... It wasn't my intent to just have that channel canceled. And it's so crazy because this channel, I had it way back when. So if you go on it, you'll see like a clip or two sprinkled in from years ago when my kids were like small and all my kids are older now, except for the one that keeps deciding he wants to pop up in the background, my five-year-old. Um, my older ones are 19... 16 and 14 and I think if you look back at those videos they were like eight and nine and stuff like that so and he may have been maybe one so I don't know those videos but I had two channels so my popular channel that was all over the place um and I was doing great I don't know what happened um however neither here nor there I'm back I'm getting started however you want to look at it I am here for you like I said I do a lot of like um I'll do a topic of the day because sometimes people just need to talk about something going on feel free down in the comments to say something about what you may be wanting to discuss you know um a lot of us have children. We talk about the issues going on with the kids, the schooling. I have my oldest that moved out, you know, kids growing up. Um, and it's not all about children. It could be work. It can be life. I'm single. I ain't got no man. You know what I mean? It could be about that whole. But we, we like to do a lot of talking. And it was really good. I had some really powerful, great sisters on there. Um, we discussed it all. And so now I'm going to do the podcast. So we are looking forward to that. And of course, that's more discussion based. However, on my YouTube, I still have my times where I want to do my live or I want to reply to comments. So still on this platform, you know, connect with me. Still connect with me. I'm not only going to be doing DIY projects and, um, you know, I do a lot of thrifting, you know, so it could be something like um my thrift store finds or you know things like that so um this light is bright and uh, my lace is not lacing but whatever i don't care so and i'm very open i'm very there i'm not no model i don't be having my edges slayed and my this and my that i don't care i'm human i'm making it god bless me and this is how we do what we do on here so if you see me and my hair might be standing up over here or my lace is lifting or my eyelashes hanging off on the end so what 
I had a hard day with the kids, a long day at work, whatever. I came on here because I wanted to talk about it. I'm your sister next door. I'm not the one over here trying to do makeup tutorials or hair tutorials or nothing else. I'm your, your home girl down the street, okay? I look like a regular person. That's what I do, okay? So if y'all see something going on, whatever, all right, let me know. Tell me. I'm going to fix it. We're going to keep it pushing. Look, people blowing up my phone. I ain't got time. I'm just trying to record. But anywho, that's just me. Um... Let's talk about it. Let's be about it. You know, whatever. It's 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 us. You know, this is sometimes sometimes people just get on YouTube just because just because I look on here, I watch funny videos. I'm watching soldiers coming home. I'm watching pregnancy announcements. Like I just love it. Like whatever brings you joy, that's what we're here for. You know, and I'm all about uplifting and empowerment. I ain't I don't have time for the negative comments. I'm gonna get somebody to race it. I don't even want to read it. Because we're not here for that. Of course, you could have an opinion and I already know somebody's going to come for me. Delete. Like, I'm not here for that. Like, okay, the subject was, I don't know, we could say something deep about Black Lives Matter or, you know, whatever the subject may be. I may say something you don't like, okay? Your family don't always agree. Say what you have to say and keep it pushing. But we're not going to deal with all that negativity. We're not going to have nothing that's going to be down in anybody on here. That's not what we do. It's all about, let's see what who had going on today. What they talking about today or, you know, whatever. So that's a lot, a lot of what the podcast is going to be about as well. Like the three of us getting together. And we may have other people join us as well. But right now it's just the three of us. But we might have, you know, deep discussions. And everybody's not going to be on the same page. That's what makes us go around like we all walk in a different part of our life where where somebody might be getting blessed over here it's not about showing off and if i bring something on my channel like hey so today i got a raise let me tell you something never showing off okay happy thankful and blessed for where i am right now what i have going on and i decide i want to share it because again my youtube page is for my family I consider you guys my family. It's not going to be, oh my gosh, here she go again. Oh, I got a brand new car. Indeed. And guess what? Little Sam that was born and raised in the projects of New York. Never seen it coming up. You darn straight. So I have my own house now. I have a luxury vehicle. And I'm raising my four kids and I'm doing a darn thing. But you know why? Because I've been blessed. And I've seen the bottom and I decided I wanted to come up to the top. So if I come on here and I say, oh, I want to tell y'all. Let me tell you what I just found out today about my car. Guess what? It's not about showing off. And matter of fact, you might have the same car. You might be able to teach me something. That's another thing. I watch a lot of videos on tricks and things. I learn something new every day. But you know, things like that. But again, nothing on here is about boasting or bragging. It's all about blessings. Being excited about your blessings. Being thankful for your blessings. And talking about it. Having somebody to talk to. Because let me tell you something. I, we always need somebody to talk to. So, with that being said, anyway, I just wanted to kind of come back on and do like my introduction back into the YouTube world. And um, this was a quick video. So, this don't be my background. I'm not going to have my door open with the little one running around and stuff like that. This was just my video today. But I'm about to get to it. And I'm mad because I should have thought about this like last week or so. Because I did so many projects y'all like and then oh shout out to a good friend of mine who's actually going to be on a podcast um this past weekend i wish i would have filmed for the page for my channel her surprise party so my sister and i which is the other one that's going to also be on a podcast um we threw a surprise party for her. We both we all live in different states. Well, my sister and I live in the same state, and then my friend lives in a different state. And she just graduated med school. Yeah, congrats. Oh, gosh, I'm so proud of her. And we threw what I believe and what everybody around us has told us, a beautiful surprise party. It, it couldn't have turned out any better. Like, God was shining on us. And when I tell you the devil was trying, the devil was trying between the planning and, you know, you have, um, I don't know what I want to call these people because I don't want to be rude. I'm just going to say not reliable. That's what we're going with. We had not reliable people left and right and the flakers and the, the party was amazing. It was beautiful. And whoever was meant to be there was there. Whoever wanted to be a part of the celebration and the growth of her life was there and that's all that matters so i wish i would have filmed it because i could have did it from start to finish so that's what i like to do um decor 
crafts, party planning. That's what I love to do, which is odd because somebody with severe anxiety being a party planner, it's a funny scene. It's a funny scene. And my kids are probably like, I wish she would find another hobby <laughs> because I love to party plan. However, the stress comes, you know, sometimes can be a lot um, when you suffer from severe anxiety. But let me tell you something. It always works out. It always works out. You know what I mean? And that's because I got him above. I can't. There is no other explanation except for. Okay. So, um, but again, I wish I would have got to film it because my sister and I did an amazing job and I'm so happy it, it, it definitely was worth it. So anywho, um, again, please add anything that, you know, you want to discuss or just stay tuned for some projects we have going on. And definitely when I get the information for the podcast, please, please, please be a part of that. I want y'all to be a part of anything that I'm doing in my life because, Again, y'all are my family. Like, the only person I ever have to talk to is my sister. So, I need y'all as friends. Like, I need this. So, but anyway, definitely um, stay tuned for everything so that you can be a part of it. Um, oh, and hair. Now, I have, to, I have to revert back really quickly. So, I don't do hair. Like I said, you heard me. Um, that's why my lace ain't really lacing. But it's crazy because it's just the light. Because in person, it's lacing. You know what I mean? You ain't going to tell me it ain't lacing. And person, I went out and this girl said, wait a minute, that thing look like it's going out your scalp. So don't worry about that white you see in there. But anyway, no, but I don't do hair. But let me tell you something. That's why I love YouTube. I I, I got on YouTube and I was determined. Now I'm going to say, because I'm going to tell y'all the ups and the downs. I'm not going to act like, no, we don't live no IG life over here. The real is the real. I got on YouTube. And I, I YouTube all these videos. And I promise you, if I could find a way, because I'm new to the whole certain parts of it, to link these wonderful, amazing women that helped me to get the confidence and the know-how to do my daughter's hair. Let me tell y'all. I can't show it to you right now, but I'm going to tell you why. This was this was months ago, and I wish I would have did it. But I'm about to do the one this weekend. So, anywho, I got on here. My daughter said she wanted some long um, forks, locks down her back. Whew. Them people was charging some money. And if y'all know me, I'm all about saving money. Anything I can learn how to do on my own, I do on my own. <clears throat> me and my daughter's here. Oh, you won't never see us looking any kind of way. But that's because I got on YouTube and I figured out how to do it myself. I used to do my own nails. They ain't work out too good. Um, lashes. Oh, I'm popping them on myself. My hair, oh, it's gonna be a wig, mm -hmm. and I'm going, I'm going to get up in there, and I'm going to do the do. So, cause I like to spend money on my home, my children. Like I, I'm, I'm big on memories. So trips, we, we always going on trips, um, things like that. That's what I'm gonna spend. Oh, my vehicle, cause you know I had to buy my vehicle, but you know things like that. So the little things. Oh, and I thrift. If you see me, this necklace, I borrowed this from my sister. Yeah, I probably got to get that back. Um, anything you see, I'm not going to say 100% of the stuff because it just ain't possible. It is, but it isn't. But most of the stuff, you better believe I thrifted it or I got it from somebody. Like this, this is, I'm going to tell y'all because this is a um, it's a Walmart shirt. Oh, I love Walmart plain tees because it could go with anything. Oh, I got to show you my skirt. I just came from my lunch at work. I got my... um. I got this from a yard sale. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This skirt is skirting, girl. Got my little boom. Okay. Um, so when I, <laughs> yeah, no, I know, I, I put it down. I thrift. Everything is thrift. If I can make it, I'm going to make it. If I can fake it, I'm going to fake it. But I'm going to tell you one thing. You won't ever see us looking any kind of way. Because I, I believe in stepping out and presenting yourself accordingly. But I'm going to go on back because y'all know I get off track. But whatever, that's what I do. I talk. That's why we family. We here to talk about things. So I uh, I YouTubed how to do these forks, long locks that she wanted because $300 was not coming out of Sam's pocket. Y'all already know me. So I, um, I oh my gosh, y'all, I got in there braided up that hair. Now I can box braid. I can't cornrow. I can't do nothing else. But I can box braid. I did them braids, did that crochet. Them locks was locking. You understand what I'm telling you? This girl done had it in for a few months now because they was slinging that well. Now it's time for them to come out. So I went on Amazon 
Amazon is the truth, y'all. Don't go. And I'm not trying to discredit any um, local beauty stores, nothing like that. But again, this page, I tell y'all if I find a way that I'm saving my coins. Of course, I know y'all already probably already know this, but I'm just saying if I can save coins, that's what I do. Now, of course, I shop at local beauty supply stores and I support local businesses. So I'm not going to say that. But what I'm going to say is if I can save money, hmm. I will. So I went on Amazon and I got this hair and I was like, oh shoot, I did it in the hers. I'm about to do this. I've been dying for some butterfly locks, y'all. Or the, the fox locks, but I want the long ones like her and down to anywho, went, ordered all this hair, got in there, couldn't couldn't get a, a, a lock. You understand what I'm telling you? I couldn't part the back of my let, let me tell y'all something, because I have to give credit. Anytime credit is due, I respect y'all women so much that could do your own hair. Because let me tell you something, I will YouTube the mess out of a video. I'll get in here and do her hair. So baby girl, stay fly. But me, not so much. No. Mm -mm. Um, I can't get the back of my head. Um, I just can't. You know what I'm saying? So I got all this hair. So I said, well, doggone it. So baby girl said, she has the, the butterfly locks right now. This was the fork locks. She said, well, I'll take it. I said, okay. So look, so when I redo her hair this weekend, let me get on here and do a video. Now, I'm not saying I, I do tutorials because I just learned from the girl in the last video and the video before that. But I can show y'all how I do it because maybe if y'all kind of be off like me, you might understand. You know what I'm saying? Like, I see some videos sometimes and I get home and think I can do it and I can't. And it's not because they didn't explain it well. The tutorial is amazing. I don't know. I think something's just wrong with me. So, if I do it, and I'm doing it a little crazy, like, and a little off, who knows? You might be like, man, you might be like, well, doggone, that works for me. So, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to help you out. So, some of the things that I do, um, oh, and I got on leggings, y'all, so I ain't, I ain't flashing nobody. But some of the things I do, you know, it might work for you. So, that's what I'm about. It, it doesn't mean that, you know... We all learn in our own ways. Again, we're all in different places. And we have to realize that. And what we also have to realize is, because let me tell you something, YouTube will get you messed up. It's not to say you can't do what everybody else do. That's not what I'm saying by far, because I am a strong believer in anything one man put on this earth can do, there's another that can do it. Anybody can do anything the other person can do. And no, they don't get crazy. Like, well, so you trying to tell me that my brother could have a baby because I had, I ain't saying genetically impossible things. But what I'm saying is as far as talents go, I feel like anything can be learned, but everybody does it differently. So though I might watch 12 videos over here and I didn't understand how she did it and I'm, I'm getting frustrated that's my baby. Say hey to the camera, Nas. Hey. Okay. Mommy gonna finish filming. Okay. So it's not to say that, you know, you can't learn or, you know, things didn't work out or anything. However it is, maybe you learn differently from somewhere else, someone else. And though my way might seem crazy and unorthodox, who knows? You might pick it up. You might be like, dog, on the way this little silly way that she didn't did it. I get it now. You know what I'm saying? So that's what I try to do. And that's why when I do that, oh my gosh, my crafts be failing. Do you understand what I'm telling you? But at the end, when I get it and it's good enough for my house, like I might make a picture or do whatever. I'm like, what dog on? No, it was kind of crazy. Or it wasn't going the way the lady on YouTube showed me how to do it. But I like the way it turned out for my house. And I'm glad that I still follow her tutorial to get in that direction. But the ending result was my result. And that's what I'm going to go with. You understand what I'm saying? So, anyway, I am going to rant and I'm going to ramble. And it might be a 30-minute video. You can skim through it. You can fast forward. Whatever you need to do. Again, I, I'm just, my channel is all about positivity. It's all about talking. It's all about, you can put something in the comments. I'm going to respond to it. Let's have a conversation about it. I'm going to do a video like, girl, so I see you said, I don't know, you went to Houston last week. What's the weather like? I, I've been to tell you all the places I went to where you need to go, what you don't need to do. You know, things that I found fun, things like that. So that's what it's about. But that's more so why I'm doing a podcast because, you know, it's a little more relatable 
thoughtful and um, kind of hands-on conversation. But this page is for everything. Talk to me about it. I am here. And I'm also going to upload some videos that I found in the archives that probably was on my old page. Um exercise videos i had videos of the kids doing challenges or just all kinds of things so with that being said again i'm so happy to be back i'm so serious i'm not leaving my family again we here we in it between here and the podcast you will always get to me because this is what i love to do i love to talk i used to love our interactions you know going live and conversating with people from all different walks in life all different people at different points in their lives so this is what we're going to do we're going to hope to be a blessing to someone be a conversation for someone maybe be an answer to someone's questions whatever we can do that's what we can do because i feel like my purpose right now in life other than being a mom because if anybody knows me they know don't nothing come before being a mom um other than that just to be able to be an uplift or a help for someone so that is that for now um again i want to say thank you and i want to say welcome or welcome back hello here we go family let's do this and um i really hope to speak to you guys soon as always, I love you, stay blessed, and I will see you soon.